guys, welcome once again to my channel from Channel with Love and Margarita. And today we're gonna be having a new experience. This is gonna be my first time riding like the speed train from Hong Kong to Shenzhen. It's very exciting because I haven't tried before. And just today, because I kind of miss like the ferry, I wanted to give this a try. And I'm gonna be taking you with me. Adventure. I am gonna go to Shenzhen through the super fast speed train. It's my first time here, guys, and it's like West Colon Station. So I think we first have to buy a ticket. Okay, this station is like looking so cool. Now we're gonna go and take out cash because they do not accept like cards for buy a ticket. I think it's 70 something, so we're gonna take out like 100 Hong Kong dollars. I'm looking for the ATM. Wow, this is my first time here. There's always new things to discover, you know? Like, it looks like wow, massive. Amazing. Okay, guys, this station is like so huge. And I'm just walking around to see what we can find here. Check this out place is like amazing okay so we have a ticket and now we are ready to depart wow it's exciting my first time here yeah baggage inspection okay we have to scan our bags now pass through the security scan and we are about to see what is next wow such a long escalator so we are riding at 8 30 and arriving at 8 50 so that's like 20 minutes really fast like so fast i think this takes longer than the ride itself but you know it's interesting to try new ways and to understand other options in any case that sometime i kind of miss the transportation elsewhere i can just come here i forget to ask until what time was this ride available and from which time i will ask and let you all guys know but tourists we are arriving here wow this is huge, 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 huge. it more looks like an airport yeah so hopefully we'll be all okay Oh, this is very cool and very quiet. Okay, this place is so big, but we already passed the immigration control, at least for the departure, and there must be an immigration control for the arrivals when we get to China, I guess. Oh, this is so big. Such a long way, you know. I think I prefer to go through the ferry. That's just a personal preference, but we will see. We haven't tried yet. This one, maybe we will end up liking it. Because they say it's so fast, but it takes quite a while to buy the ticket and go through all these uh, securities, procedures. Compared to the ferry, you just buy the ticket and just go through, hoping that ferry and after an hour you are there in Shaku but of course the time difference it's a lot one hour compared to like 20 minutes it's a lot I am inside the gates so there are different gates as you can see like 15b 14b we are in gate number 18b but it's still not open we're waiting for it because it opens really like 15 minutes just before the train is leaving and we are leaving at 8.30 and it's just 8.10 so we still have to wait for a while but this is how this place is looking like it's huge like wow. oh there's a smoking room it is smoking room there smoking room there I wonder okay I'm just gonna sit here for a while because I have to wait this place is like so big but there's like little uh, seats. Anyways, my stuff is here. 
They are calling our train, so it's time to go. Yeah, it's so fast, really. Wow. Shenzhen Bay has started. Please enter at gate Okay, we need to go and line up because it will leave like us up. Are you ready? So now I'm heading to the enter. Okay, I have to be boarding soon because the train is gonna be leaving very, very fast. Sally? Okay, we are going inside. How exciting! Seriously, I'm always in for new adventures, new experiences. And of course, sharing with you guys like how does this really work. So, yeah. Oh, sorry, by the way, this ticket was 84 Hong Kong dollars. But I heard from a Chinese friend like you can buy it online, cheaper. How? I'm not really sure. There's like an APP called like 1, 2, 3, 0, 6 or something like that. So, yeah. So, for those of you wondering what is the name of this station, is Hong Kong West Como. Okay, we are in the car number 7, 1A. Wow, I have to be fast, guys. Like, I'm just afraid that this train will leave me. Entering the train, this is the car number 7, and I have to look for my seat. Oh, wow, new experience, huh? 1A. 1... I think maybe it's there. So this looks pretty nice. New and comfortable. I feel like it looks like a plane. Yeah. Do you guys think so? It's like a plane. Okay, which is the number one? One A is there. So that's my seat. Ah, my seat. Okay, first of all, guys, this place is very, very spacious. So, like, there's a lot of space for your legs. You know, like a lot. And even my bags in here. So it's quite nice, comfortable. So this works like this, and we are ready here. Okay, I'm not gonna go ahead, it just keeps going. But, anyways, you have some space here to put like, your luggage and. Just it looks like that. I was wondering whether there is a toilet, but at least I don't think it's one here. Automatic doors, yeah, great. You can put your luggage up there. So, a lot of you guys are constantly traveling from Hong Kong to Shenzhen or from Hong Kong to Guangzhou. So previous to this trip, I usually took like the ferry or the metro, like Luohu or the bus even. Like the buses will go out from like different ports and Futian will be Huanggang Koan and you can take bus to like different locations in Hong Kong depending your destination, for example, Chim Sha Shui or like Central, etc. And you can also take the bus from Shenzhen Wang Kuan. Uh, I used to take it from there previously when I was living in Nanshan district because they are in different locations around the center. Um, that port is more convenient for those who are living in Nanshan or perhaps Shekou compared to Huangan for those living in Futian or Luohu. So now we are gonna be riding this express speed train that will be taking us to Shenzhen Bay which is like the North, Shenzhen North railway station. And this time we're gonna be riding the speed train that will be taking us from this Kowloon. How is this called? This station is like Hong Kong West Kowloon. There are two options. By the way, you can also choose to go to Futian, but I decided to go to Shenzhen Bay. And why is that I decided so? Because there's a vegan restaurant nearby that I wanna go to have dinner too, so yeah. <laughs> Basically, I'm super hungry. So it's kind of taking a while to the part. I think that takes longer to the wait than the actual ride. But anyway, so the train looks super clean and tidy. And yeah. Let me know in the comment section. Oh wow, we are leaving. Yeah. Okay, let's 
see how much does it take and how is the view outside I'm really wondering because I'm used to take like speed trains to go to the mountain area in China like other cities and there will be always like beautiful scenery but I wonder how is this view gonna be like and let me know in the comment section which kind of transportation you will prefer when traveling from Hong Kong to Shenzhen or from Shenzhen to Hong Kong or even from Wanzhou, you know, because there's still like a possibility to go from Wanzhou directly to Hong Kong or from Hong Kong directly to Wanzhou. Yeah. Especially when it's like the Canton Fair, a lot of people is coming here from Hong Kong because their planes arrive to Hong Kong. I guess it's like a very international airport and there are more like airlines there as well as more arrivals and departures but yeah. Would you prefer bus, ferry, metro or speed train? We have already four options in here or even you have the helicopter <laughs> but I think that's not an option for many of us. Nonetheless maybe you might need one riding it. So let us all know how is it. Oh. Okay, here is very dark outside. I cannot see anything. Can you see that? Mm. I thought that we would be able to see something. Perhaps I, I have to wait for a while. Something nice from the speed train is that the China migration as well as the Hong Kong migration are both there. Once you get your ticket, you go through like the Hong Kong immigration and just right away you go into the Chinese immigration. So you are done, not like the ferry. Uh, when you leave like China, you are passing through the Chinese migration and once you arrive to Hong Kong, then you pass through the Hong Kong migration, right? In here, it's all done at once. I like that actually. So now I'm in China, I'm riding this train, I don't have to arrive uh, to my destination and then check in for like entry, you know? transfers there is like metro there is taxi and I'm going for the taxi and here is like buses but we are not taking a bus so we are going to go that way for the taxi so guys if you have watched my previous videos here in the channel you might know that I really enjoy traveling in the speed trains in China because it's super comfortable super clean you know it's a whole experience super fast I think it's even better than traveling in plane because in plane you have to check in your luggage you have to go through security scan although you have to go to security scan here as well but it's not as troublesome as in the airplane like you have to arrive like two hours in advance or one hour at least and you know all these procedures compared to like railway speed train 
you know, is the next thing. Come on. And yeah, what about you? Do you enjoy traveling in the railway speed train or not? So once we made it to here, Shenzhen Beichan or Shenzhen North Railway Station, where to go eat? I know a very good vegan restaurant nearby, so we are heading there right now because I'm so very hungry. Hey, yo. Need food. Yeah, and everybody's looking at me with the camera. I guess they also want to appear on my video. Yeah. By the way, guys, do not forget your ticket or miss it or, you know, whatever, because most of the times they will ask for the ticket at the exit. And if you do not have it, there was a time where they charged me again because I lost it and I had to pay for it. Like, what? So just have it with you all the time, Yunyu. To avoid any problem because they will always like kind of ask it there before you go through the exit doors. I don't know why but that's the way it is. So now I'll, I'll, I'll show you. We have to go through this. And they wanna see the ticket. Okay. So we are out. Yeah. Welcome to Shenzhen, Beijing. So guys, we are about to take the taxi. There are a lot of taxis here, so you don't have to worry about that. So this is dinner for today. This soup is so delicious. Mm -hmm. And the mushrooms. Yeah. Yummy, yummy. And we have the tea here. Let's start the lights. About to leave. Already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. 